All right. So I decided to take down my Fasco Charleston. Um, I got some good hopes for it though. I'm probably going to, I don't know, sell it to a collector on vintage fan, uh, vintage silly fans forums or keep it. I don't want to just sell it on Marketplace. I actually want to sell it to someone who uh, would appreciate this Fasco Charleston. Let's see if I decide to sell it. I haven't really made up my mind yet, but I scored some more Hunter Originals. My place is a wreck. So I got two more plain whites. I know a while back I scored two overseas originals that are hung out in the front porch. Um, those were, as, as soon as I started overseas, you know, one was two thousand uh, late uh, December of 2002, and the other one was 2003. Well, this is just before they went overseas. So this is uh, a 2001 original with the two amp motor. I just had it upside down to drain all the oil out of the cup. I'm gonna use a paper towel to clean all the oil out of that present weather. Um, these are the originals that I was really after because I heard lots of good things. Well, one good thing about the two amp originals that they are the fastest. I think it's just by a smidge, but uh, I do have my favorites, you know, like I do like the 70s Robins and Myers and Chestnut Brown, you know, two speed. I like those for some reason and I like the white and brass finish which was which ironically my very first original was white and brass and it was a 100 year anniversary so that was nice I've just been doing well on the Hunter originals and I I, I can't complain I ain't complaining <laughs> Shit. so I have this 2001 and I have a, uh, a 2000 in my trunk um, so I got these for 80 bucks total so that ain't bad, you know, 40 bucks a piece for four to five blade uh, USA Originals right before they went overseas. This one has a circle. I don't know if this is the other original that I looked at. I was trying to look for the circle, but I didn't see one. Maybe my freaking hand was over it when I was carrying it. But yeah, I got a nice score. Got me some late American Originals right before they went overseas with the two amp motors. I'm kind of like you know, bummed that they're just playing white, but you know what, you, you gotta grab them before, you, you gotta save them before they go, you know, so, I just like, screw it, I'll go, I, I don't, I don't, I'm not a fan of playing white, it's just a little on the boring side, I do like, kind of like, you know, brass, or antique brass, or, it's, I just like, you know what, I changed my mind, I'll go out there and get it, so, but, the Fasco, I just ran, I just tried to find wood uh, a very stupid way of just driving screws through the roof till I finally found a beam. Well, that's where I hung the Fasco. But, look, I really wanted to make sure that there was wood there, and I'm glad there is. There's a big, giant beam right there. And I don't even think that's a 2x4, I think that's like a 2x6. So, that's good, that's good. And I am going to hang him my favorite way. There we go. I got, what, I think these are two and a half inch lag bolts. That these are gonna go through the U-bolt, wherever the hell that's at. It's like a man's workshop in here. So yeah, two lag bolts right through here, right into the wood. That'd be perfectly fine. We got a goofy ass right here. <laughs> so. Where's the bush now? Oh, it's over there on the table. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and get to hanging this fan. Oh, um, since I got both of these fans for 80 bucks, 40 for one, the other one, I'm probably gonna flip it, probably for like 150 bucks, you know. It'd be a nice little extra cash in my pocket. I think, <laughs> I think anybody who knows what Hunter Originals are would appreciate, you know, an American Original for 150 bucks. So, that's not, that's not a bad price. At least I, I think. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and get this done and over with. I feel bad for the Charleston, though. <laughs> it's like, man, he's gotta take me down. He's gonna replace me. Yeah, it's alright. 
I'll find a good spot for it or get uh, or sell it to someone who will appreciate it.